I want to do the same problem that I did in the last video. But I want to show you that there's multiple ways to solve these problems that should hopefully give you the right answer if you do them in the right way. So once again, one pipe can fill a pool one and a half times faster than a second pipe. If both pipes are open, the pool can be filled in six hours. If only the slower pipe is open, how long would it take to fill the pool? So as I said in the last video, whenever you do these problems, it's very important to think in terms of rate, the rate at which the slower pipe can fill a pool and the rate at which the faster pipe can fill a pool. Now right over here, I'm going to define that the slower pipe, the slower pipe can fill a pool in R. So its rate is R pools per hour. R pools per hour. So if its rate is R pools per hour, and R for rate, what is the faster pool's rate? The faster pool's rate is going to be 1, 1.5 times R. It's 1, 1 1.5 times faster. It has 1.5 times the rate. So it's going to be able to do 1.5 R pools, pools per hour. And what's their combined rate? Well, you can add the rates. R plus 1.5 R, so let me write this in orange. So if you say their combined rate, their combined rate is r plus 1.5. What am I doing? Plus 1.5 r, 1.5 r pools per hour, pools per hour, which is equal to 2.5 pools per 2.5 r pools per hour, pools per hour. And they're also telling us they're, they're telling us that their combined rate, if both pipes are open. The pool can be filled in six hours. So they're telling us that the combined rate is one pool in every six hours. So they're saying that the combined rate is also, so this is also equal to one pool in every six hours, or one sixth of a pool per hour. One pool in every six hours. One pool in every six hours is the same thing, so that's this line right over here. One pool in every six hours, the same thing as one sixth of a pool per hour, one sixth pools per hour. And then once again, we have 2.5 r is equal to one sixth. We can multiply both sides, so we, let me do it this way. We can multiply both sides by six. Let me just rewrite it so I have some real estate. 2.5 r, the units are the same on both sides, so really this needs to be equal to this. So 2.5 r needs to be equal to 1 6. You can multiply both sides by 6. This just becomes 1. This right over here, 6 times 2.5 is 15. So you get 15 r is equal to 1, or r is equal to 1 15th. And let's see how that might make sense. So we know that the slower pool is, one, is r pools per hour. Or we could say it is 1 15th of a pool 1 15th of a or 1 15th of a pool per hour or you could view it as it takes one to do one pool it takes 15 hours so once again to answer our question if only the slower pipe is open how long would it take 15 15 hours so once again the exact same problem we did in the last video just a different way and frankly a little bit simpler although i went into a little bit more detail in the last video so i don't know if, if i can make that comparison